So this here is the Royal Theatre and this is something that happens every Christmas. Elks. I don't know why. Quite lovely. I think it's mostly for the tourists. He's working as a dresser in a musical show. He don't know how to sing and he can't rhyme very well. But he takes a lot of movies and he's vegan, you know. It's the vegan gay dresser. In today's episode, how do you do winter? Welcome. Do you want to see something lethally cute? Hmm? Do you? Do you? You do, don't okay, you? Okay, so it's really important that I don't scare the living daylight out of him. But he sort of made himself at home on my sort of really messy balcony. Don't look at the balcony. So he's sort of plundering the bird feeder with my... Well, I, I sort of... I want him to. Now he's listening to my voice, I guess. Should I call him something? Squire. In today's episode, I'm on a quest for fiction, fact, phenomenon, things start with an F. So this is at the Swedish, no, the Stockholm Dramatic School, I guess you can call it. The Stockholm Dramatic College. High school? College. Yeah. So this is said to be inspired by Godot's play, uh, Waiting for... No, <laughs> Beckett's play, Waiting for Godot. I'm going to see it with my friend Mats, who's... I'm going to show you a picture of him right so His now. name is Mats Limber, and uh, there are li literally thousands of thousands of Swedes called Mats Limber, but this is him in his younger days. Don't tell him that I said that, but he's... This is sort of... So it's raining outside. So I'm dressed for the weather. I'm late. I have no excuse, just bad mathematics. Yeah, I hopefully this is the place. Otherwise I'm terribly wrong. So this is Mats, looking very intelligent and refined. Say hello, Mats. Hello. Now I'm on my bike on my way to Söder, which is another one of the bigger islands in Stockholm. And I'm gonna meet my friend Mats again and we're gonna eat. I'm gonna eat, he might just drink. He likes to drink. Quite a charming show. It was sort of a, more like a presentation of, of a work, I guess. It's quite charming. I was a bit hurried and I would love to see more of the Process, thought process, like the thoughts, the, what were they were thinking, because now they sort of just, it's, well, they were hurried and just said the words sometimes. So this here is the Royal Theatre and this is something that happens every Christmas. Elks. I don't know why. Quite lovely. I think it's mostly for the tourists. We're about to go into Phil's Burger. Is it the first time for day? Yeah. This is his Beyond Meat Burger. Phil's Burger. So I said goodbye to Mats and now I'm going home to get do some reading, some writing and some something with R. So you know how you sometimes wonder that how the blind don't get lost because you can't see anything so if they forgot where they are they can't sort of, where am I? So I just met a blind person who was lost.